October 22nd, 916 p.m. <coughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> uh, I, uh, I actually had a pretty good weekend, you know. Um, I took the kids to the park, and I wanted to get on here and kind of tell you a story um, about what happened to me t today. Okay, so I want to say right around 6 o'clock is when people started showing up, you know, to, to the park. Like a bunch of kids showing up to the park. So the kids are running around playing. And um, we had got, we had been there since like 5 p.m. or something like that. And uh, we didn't leave until it got dark. Well, anyway, within that time frame, uh, there was a point where Cricket wanted to go swing on the little handicap swings. You know, the ones that have like, they had the four... They have the four chains that kind of make like an upside down V shape, so they're they you can make them go higher, right? Oh. Well, there was a girl over there, a really, really gorgeous, and uh, she was pushing her son, who was not that old at all, had to be at least like 18 months maybe. Anyway, she's swinging him. I put Cricket next to to him. And, the, you know, there's only two swings. So the, there goes her pushing her son and me pushing Cricket. So we're, her and I are standing right next to each other. And they're sitting right next to each other. And we're swinging back and forth. Anyways, let me just describe what this girl was wearing. She was wearing, like, a, a long, a long sleeve black shirt that was, like, up to maybe her collar. You know, like, up there so it wasn't showing nothing. She had a long skirt that had, uh, it went down to like mid shin and it had sunflowers on it and stuff with the lace around the bottom. And she had the long black boots, like stripper boots. What I liked about it was that it wasn't too revealing. I think that is a very good indication of a woman who pretty much respects herself and uh, respects her body. Anyways, I wanted to ask her what her name was, and uh, not too long after I had this thought of asking her what her name was, two other kids walk up, one being at least Allie's age, maybe seven, and then a boy that was my son's age, about 11 years old. I was like, oh, never mind. <laughs> Because those were her children, had to be her children. They were spitting image of her. I mean, I just wanted to get on here and tell you guys that because I thought it was hilarious. Because that that changed my mind. I, I have enough kids. I have four children. So I don't, like if I was to mingle with this girl, then I would have seven children. So fuck that. <laughs> Anyways, other than that, I had a pretty good weekend with the girls, and uh, they're just, they just make my day, they make my day so much better. They take up a lot of my time, but that time keeps my mind busy, so it doesn't really, you know, it, it takes my mind off a lot of things, uh, a lot of very... A lot of things that are really hurtful towards me, but I'm I'm done being that way. Like I said, and I don't. I'm just I'm better than that, man. I don't need to. I don't need to be that way. You know what I'm saying? I am still hurt. I'm still upset about it, but I'll get over it. You know, things are getting easier because I'm doing exactly what I was doing before. So. Uh, I know that I don't really have much more to say than that, so it was a short video, um, so yeah, I hope you guys have a good rest of your weekend, and hopefully the drop-off goes well for me when I drop the kids off, so, uh, later.